Nobody told me how lonely being a man is. I had closer friendships with random women I met in the bathroom before I transitioned at clubs because of how open women are than I've had in my eight years of transitioning. Because women are just so much more vulnerable and deep than men. But to have known, and I think a lot of trans men feel this, is we knew what de depth felt like before we transitioned. We knew what it felt like to like have people want to hug us. And to have people want to talk to us. And to have a community. And then you transition and you're just a guy walking down the street that people cross the street so that they're not near you. And friendships are so much harder to build. And people are colder. And what's hard is none of Nobody told me how. Guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Talking to myself, the channel. I'm your host, Nick. And we're back with another video. And today, guys, we're going to be talking about the video that you just seen. Also, we got White Elbow oh, here. It's me. Knee, elbow, one and two. Same difference. Um, <laughs> the video you just seen was a woman transitioning to a man, been doing it for the last eight years, and complaining or very emotional about how tough it is making relationships with men. Hey, yo, hey, niggas get shot every day, B. You be I, nigga. You tough, right? So let's just go over the quick tidbits. She's been transitioning. Well, he's been transitioning for eight years. It's a great beard, by the way. It's a great beard. I want to say it's a good looking beard. It is. You know, I better than mine, honestly. Um, vulnerability and deep. This is the thing I feel that a lot of people that transition from women to men need to realize that as much as we do the transitioning, we're doing the hormone changes and those things, I just think the essence of the women is still there and understanding how men operate like their mindset yeah mindset. yeah yeah it's not the same right like i don't mind being alone you know if i have i have a lot of friends and i'm grateful for the friends that friendships i have but i want to stress so much if i didn't have them and i think those connections that it's easy to make as a woman you still want those connections you still want those genuine with this basic level of like communication sometimes when you just see women out and it's not like that when you're a man. <laughs> well, he said it's easier to make friends when you're a woman, and that's true. Yeah. Because we're more like open and. I think you go to if you go to events and go to places where men are, you can make friends. Yeah, but it's not like women. Like we can literally become friends, like he said in the bathroom, at a club, over. The simple fact that we need chapstick or like just something mm -hmm. like so small like that you can't do that with no like men no but there are, it's different men become friends easy is different it's a little like video games like it just kind of interest I just think this is the thing when you transition even when a man transition into a woman right. There are certain essence, certain things that is not, you can't get through a hormone. You can't get through just because how you feel, right? I just think there are just certain things that that makes a woman a woman. I'm not trying to be homophobic or anything. I think everybody should be tired to feel how they feel, but I think it's just certain things that are just missing. Um, not even just from a physical standpoint, just from a point of just like that thing you can't teach, I guess. Yeah. And I think it sucks for that person, because obviously you did the work for eight years trying to make yourself feel amazing about how you feel and doing all the things you needed to do for those changes to only transition into something and now realize the full gravity of what it is, right? Because I guess I don't see it, the well, problem. Men and women interpret things different and him still technically being a woman inside, one, yeah. he is interpreting things the way women do. 
even know to he's, society he's a man. Yes. And you can relate the way you interpret things. So that is why women relate to women and men relate to well, men. Well, what and sucks? Now you're a man trying to relate to men, but you're really a woman. But what sucks about it is you feel you you always been a man inside. Right. That's why you do the transition in the first place because you feel right. Right. That's what needs to be. Yeah. That needs to be done, and you do it, <laughs> and then you realize. Oh, <laughs> I feel alone. I feel alone, which is a lot of men feel alone. A lot of men don't like to make friends. A lot of men right. don't talk as much. A lot of men keep to themselves. A lot of men do things differently. It's different when you go out now. A woman's not talking to you. You know, you're more looked at as like a threat. You know, whatever those things are. So people kind of look you out your way. So you kind of alone a lot. And I guess without a lot of men noticing it, we just not all men thrive in that. I said right. all men, but a lot of men just like, all right, well, you know, it is what it is. Right. A lot of things are just shrugged that's how off. Interpret it. Well, a lot of things are just shrugged off. Yeah. As for women, this is a big deal. This is a problem. I need to change some things. I need to make friends. I like to be sociable. And everybody is social creatures regardless. But I just think a lot of people, a lot of this person in particular, um, it's, it's a crisis because you feel like a man, you transition. But you're still interpreting things as more women instinct. Yeah. I'm saying it, not men don't think like this, but more women instinct, and it sucks because then you're like, <coughs> you're stuck. Because you're sad in that way, but you're yeah. happy because you feel like you are who you're supposed to be now because you transitioned to be a man. And then the difficulties. So it's like a. Yeah, you get, and then you're dealing with the difficulties of. All the things you had to deal with just from the transition to transition well, like to go he, through the difficulties <laughs> of being who you are. Right, because he said he felt more support as he was transitioning. Now that he's an actual man, those people aren't there anymore because he's no longer transitioning. Yeah. And that's and then so I don't know. I feel like this I feel like there are groups and support groups for people right. like that. That comes down and it's like, you know, for me. I don't know. Like I said, I'm a guy. Maybe he found that now that he's put himself out there, like saying how he feels. Maybe people reaching out now yeah. because it went viral and people and a lot of men was like snitching it, saying like, "Man, no, you be alright." Because this is what it is to right. be a man. A lot of people, this is what it is, and um, which sucks because I feel like as men, man, I feel like we need to have more community. Which there are a lot of men that's more community, but I just think. You gotta understand there are just certain things that men do that just when you're a man you just get it. Just like as a woman, there are just certain things women do they just get. It. Right. You know, so I don't know guys, let me know how you feel about it. Then we talked about it in the comments below. I'm gonna see you in the next one. Peace.